this is how you test an armature to see if it's good or not. There's actually three tests you can do. First of all, you set your multimeter to ohms, the lowest setting on your multimeter. And you get the two probes and you do the first test, which is called the 180 degree test. So you go for this, you connect to this bar and the bar directly opposite. Which is 180 degrees. And you'll get a value up in your multimeter which is 0.2 at this state in this case. And what you do is you remember that value you recorded and keep going all the way around 180 degrees to the next bar to the next bar to the next bar. 180 degrees all the way around. It doesn't matter what the value is on the screen as long as it's consistent all the way around. And the next bar test would be the side by side bar test. If you do that, you should get the same value as well. And again, you go to the next bar. And you should get the same value. If you get the same value all the way around, the armature is good. I've tested this one. That is the case with this one. Um, the third test is called the continuity test. So, um, you can, I prefer to set the multimeter to the bell test, basically, when I'm doing the continuity test. So there should be no continuity between the bar and the stack, and you go all the way around again, like that. So just do that again, PC. Go all the way around the stack like that. And if it doesn't ring out, and the value stays at 1, everything's good. If there's no bell, all is well. So that's the three tests. They test an armature. Why I removed this one is the actual bearing ceased. The rest of the electronic wiring of this armature is perfect. So that's how you test an armature to see if it's good.